hey guys welcome back to our youtube channel login 8 today in this video i am going to show you how to create usps.com account on pc usps stands for united states postal service it is one of the us mail or postal service which is independent agency to create usps account once open any web browser available on your pc i am using google chrome now go to your search bar and type www.usps.com then press on enter with that you will be taken to official website of usps now here you can see register slash sign in option at top right section of the website click on register slash sign in now here you'll be taken to the sign in page. On the right side here you can see new to USPS. You can see you can create USPS account for the following purpose. Now click on sign up now. With that here you'll be taken to the registration page. Now here you need to first choose your language and username. Click on the language box and choose a default language for USPS. Now, Enter a username which will uniquely identify you with the United States Postal Service. After that, you need to enter a password. Make sure your password has following characteristics. Then re-enter your password on the given box. After doing so, now here you need to pick two security questions. First click on select first question box and select one of the question. After that, enter the answer on the given box. Then re-enter your answer. This will be important if you forgot your password. So make sure that you remember the security question and the answer that you have provided. Now select the second question and enter your answer in the given box. Then re-enter your answer. Now select which type of account you would like to create. Choose personal account if you are interested in services for your home. Choose business account if you are interested in solutions for business. I am choosing personal account. After selecting the type of account, now here you need to enter your contact information. First, select the title of your name. After doing so, enter your first name on the given box. Then enter your middle initial. Then enter your last name on the given box. Now, select your suffix by clicking on the given box. It is an optional choice. After doing so, enter your email address on the given box. Now, re-enter your email address. Now, select the type of phone number. Then, enter the phone number on the given box. Now, enter your EXT. It is an optional choice. Now, you can also enter the mobile phone number. It is for US only. It is also an optional choice. Now select how can USPS contact with you, whether from USPS directly or from USPS partners. After doing that, scroll down, then here you need to find your home address. First select your country, then enter your street address. After that you can also enter your apartment suit number, then enter your city name, then select your state, then enter your zip code. Know that updates to your online account do not trigger an official USPS change of address. So after filling all information, click on verify address. After that, you need to verify your address. Now here you can see whether you want to choose your original address or the possible addresses. After choosing the address, click on continue. Then click on create account. With that, your account will be created. As you can see here, my account has been registered. Now you need to go through your inbox in your mail. Now look for the mail sent by USPS. Open the given mail. Then click on click here in blue highlight so that you can validate your email address. With that, you'll be guided to the website of USPS. Now you can see your email has been validated. Click on continue to usps.com. With that, here you'll be taken to the website of usps.com and your account will be created. As you can see here, my account has been created. This is how we can create USPS account on PC. This is it for tutorial everyone. Hope this tutorial was helpful to you all. If you liked this tutorial, make sure you like, share, subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tutorials like this. Thank you for watching.